welcome to Game the Game. I'm your host, Becca Scott, and today we are playing Harry Potter Funkoverse. Let me introduce you to my guests. Matt Acevedo! Hello, hey everyone, so good to be here. Matt, you are, you've been here for a while as a producer. I know, I know, here I am at this table. But you can also be found on the internet for That's right. Ultimate Fictional Character Podcast. That's right, check it out guys, it's a lot of fun. So yeah. in this show, you have fictional characters uh, debate who's the best? Yeah, we randomly pull people from a bucket and then uh, like all fiction. And How do you then... fit people in that bucket? I won't talk. <laughs> <laughs> and then we, we have a, a conversation as to more of like what makes these characters great uh, as to like a strength battle. And we decide uh, who we think is the best one. And then it's like bracket style. It's a lot of fun. Incredible. And Mizui Karami. Hello. Oh, hi. I'm so sorry, what is a strength battle? Oh, it's like who would be winning a fight. Okay, cool. Yeah. I just wanted to clarify for me. <laughs> yeah, we'll have one later. Okay, great. Great. Minsui <laughs> can be found at minsui.com slash shorts to find your short films. Yeah. Because you are a creator of short films. That's true. Also and longer long films. ones? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not movies, films. <laughs> All sizes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Small, medium, and large. Yeah. That's how we quantify, yeah. I think so. Cool. And if you do it any other way, I'm mad at you. Yeah, don't <laughs> get on Minsui's bad side. No. It's painful for those involved. Yeah. Kate Elliott! Hi! hi. Oh, hi. Hello, it's, thank you for having me. It is my great pleasure. Very appropriate. It's so, oh, because you're British. Because of the, yeah. The That's <laughs> real? <laughs> what? I know, I've been putting on for about, 30 years. What did you so look at just now? That was my, my life watch. Oh. My time's oh. right. I've only got like four hours left. So. Yeah. It's, it's measured in freckles. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, Kate, of course, everyone knows, is an oftentimes host for Geek and Sundry stuff. And you have a Twitch channel. Kate is online. I do. I just started streaming games from home. Please come hang out. I'd love to see you. Awesome. Well, now we are hanging out. Yes. The hanging out is initiated, and you are involved as well, and we are going to play Harry Potter Funkoverse. Yes. Now, if you would like to know the rules of this game, there is a link in the description below to another Funkoverse video, and the rules are the same, the base core rules. For this scenario, we're playing Flags. It's a... Uh, Oh, similar to a childhood game you may remember, Capture the Flag. Mm -hmm. I'm very familiar with that. Yeah. Had a lot of cul-de-sac days, you know? Oh, I also had cul-de-sac days. Right, it, it was, was the best. near a cul-de-sac, not in the cul-de-sac, but so, I knew the kids. Yeah, so you were the friend who would like, you would come in and like, and see them playing outside and then join them. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> neighborhood games. Yeah. You didn't have neighborhood games? No, I did have neighborhood games. There were only two kids in the neighborhood, so. We had a, we played basketball. So. <laughs> I've heard of it. Yeah, yeah, a little, a little game. Yeah, yeah. Do you play cul de sac games? I didn't play capture the flag, but I did play push your friends down in the grass. Oh yeah, that's a fun one. Yeah, we had a similar one. <laughs> just the two of you? Yeah, it was just we would push each other over. Just, mm. Yeah. You Once one's you down, the other one can't push very well. No, you reset. And that's oh. very similar <laughs> to the mechanics of this game. That's true, it is. <laughs> because you can get knocked down and then knocked out. But the ways we can gain points and whichever team gets to 10 points first wins, is first, you could begin a round adjacent to the opponent's flag. Mm -hmm. If you do that, you teleport back to your starting area and gain two points. Oh, we didn't have that growing up. We had <laughs> that yeah. for basketball, we had two points. Oh, oh you didn't have teleportation? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Every time you score, you go back to the other Yeah, yeah, yeah. You also could knock out a rival. So first you knock them down, then you knock them out, and if you do that, you get one point. Okay. And we have A, B, C, and D points markers on the board. If you go to one of those adjacent to it, which can be diagonal, counts as going to one, and you can interact with that marker in order to take it off the board and claim a point, then that marker will go to the four of your cooldown counter mm -hmm. and will respawn on the board after four rounds. <laughs> and uh, those are the ways in which you can score points. Sweet. You ready? Yes. I'm ready. Yeah. Now, you two are representing the Hogwarts students and we two are representing the Death Eaters. <laughs> I should also mention that we are playing with the expansion, which gives us the ability to play with six different characters. The expansion comes with Ron on the good guy side and Draco on the bad guy side. Ooh, yeah. Bad person. Misunderstood I person, I think. Misunderstood, yes, that's yeah, true. Yeah, he's had a hard life. Yes. Yeah. Ron? No, uh, yeah, Ron. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, to see which side goes first, Kate, would you flip <gasps> this token? Good guys. Oh, we go first. Yeah. Awesome. All right. I really helped to whisper whatever you whispered before. <laughs> Thank like, you for the hint. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We want the last say. 
That's actually not a bad strategy. Because yeah. it's the final say. So are we ready to get this thing going? <laughs> yeah. We, we, yeah. Let's just do this. Yeah. Do this. So uh, on your turn, you can choose which of your three characters to activate, and then it'll come to our turn. Sweet. Great. I think, uh, Minzwe, I think we we wanted to get uh, her, uh, Harry into position, so we're going to move him close to uh, our point B. B point. So we're going to double move him so for two actions. So we're going first action will be one, two, two movement, and the second action will be three, four movement. And yeah. we, we can't claim this yet because we exhausted Harry. So Harry is He's now... He's tired, and we're going to put this thing on him. Yes. On his face. Mm, interesting. Oh, now I'm thinking maybe second was probably better to go. Mm. Yeah, but we didn't have a strategy. choice, though. Oh, that's yeah, okay. Okay. <laughs> it wasn't up to us. Oops. <laughs> okay, here's what I'm thinking. I want to get Voldemort close to D because Draco has an action that is helped if someone else is close to a cool thing. Yeah, I like that. If Vold, 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 Vold goes... Voldy boy. Voldy boy goes <laughs> one, two, three, four... He, yes. uh, that would take both of his actions this turn, but he's he's so ready to mm -hmm. come after sweet uh -huh. young Harry oh, in the okay. future. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're I gonna move it. Voldemort. A one, a two, a three, a four. Solid move. Hello, mm -hmm. Harry boy. <laughs> Similar. <laughs> well then, that's gonna be exhaust Voldemort, and we're gonna go ahead so and- tired. I, I, I think we should, because Hermione, like, Hermione has like, a good amount of range for us. Yeah. Um, I think, Let's in general, back. Ron and Hermione should kind of work together to work that corridor. Yeah. So we should move that Hermione over there. Um, and we could double move her. Yeah. Yeah. Can we move her diagonally through this or no? This um, we cannot. That's we a cannot. wall. Okay. Yes. So cool. we're going, we're going so to go one, first action, two, diagonal. Two. Second action, three, three. And then go go diagonal this, this way. way. Yeah. <gasps> Four. Mm. She's a bank teller. Excellent. And ex it, she will be exhausted. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I'm all walking. Ugh, so much work. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you're in Gringotts Bank. There's a lot of walking in the Harry Potter. Yeah. It's our turn. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Here's my plan. Okay. Draco is gonna move. One, two, and then he will cast Serpent Soria, which means place a serpent minion token. Yeah. In a square Draco can see within two squares. Uh, when Draco becomes exhausted, the serpent may do a challenge two or move three. So this little mm. serpent oh. boy. That's that's a, that's a solid ability. Yeah. What's his range? Two squares. So within range? two squares. Yeah, go for my. And then uh, couldn't challenge this turn, but could move and challenge next turn. I like it. Okay. It's kind of blocking this point. Yeah. So we'll move inside of Gringotts with Serpent Sorcha. And now, oh, that actually happened. First, Drago became exhausted, and then after he becomes exhausted, then the snake moves. So that's what he do. Oh, uh, we'll move it three, or maybe just move it up to two over there. Yeah, sure. Awesome. So now I, I feel we're on the same page about this R next. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You go for it. I feel really sure. good about this move. So we're gonna use Ron's. Um, Ren well, you say. I, what, I think we can. <laughs> we ha he has an ability called renovate. Renovate. renovate which is like a, a redneck saying renovate. But like. Um, we're gonna <laughs> renovate this. We're gonna renovate. Which lets um, Ron. <laughs> which gives Ron the ability to make up to two allies do a basic action. Yeah. And since we have these two here next to these points, we're gonna have their action be. However. Yes. Yes. Do they have to be in line of sight of Ron? No, it no. just says up to two allies may do a basic action, limited what? once per turn. Not anywhere near Ron. Not anywhere near Ron. It just says it doesn't what? say it has Isn't to be next to. Isn't renovating like related to like apparating and like that kind of thing? Ooh, but you. <sighs> Can I see your card? That is such yeah. a good ability. Thank you yeah. very much. Thank you. It's you almost check like it out. the good guys should win in this story. Yeah. <laughs> well, you guys got a cool snake. A little snakey. Yeah, snake. you got a snake. I got a wow. snake. Right? Isn't that cool? Wow. Yeah. So we're wow. going to use that ability and we're going yeah, to exhaust. And also, like in the future, just believe us. No. Um. <laughs> no. All right. Now so that. you place that token on yes. four? Yes. So we exhausted that and they're going to capture. Mm -hmm. uh, sure. They interact. So they're going to do their basic action. So we get point B and point A. 
<laughs> okay, so take those points and put them on the four space of your cooldown track. And that's two points for you, boy. Yeah. Thank you. And he's not done yet. I think we're going to actually advance him forward. Uh, yeah. So we're going to do. What? We're gonna, that's one move. And then his second move is going to go one. Oh, I'm just going to help Hermione. Right there. Mm -hmm. Sweet. That's wow. What he, that's what he said. That's what he Hogwarts like. really teaches some good abilities. I'm yeah. impressed. Yeah. Bellatrix, what can you do? She could just move in for the point. Before, she could stand on top of C, and if someone had to end their turn adjacent to it in order to Love grab it. it. Let's do it. Yeah? Okay. Move her in. Move, and move again, and she'll get it next time. Mm-hmm. We have ended a round, oh, so wow. we'll take first player. Thank mm -hmm. you. All right. All now, right. first things first, let's see if anyone is in the opposing team's starting area uh, or near their flag. No one is. Mm -hmm. So then we will slide down all tokens on the cooldown track mm -hmm. and uh, remove all exhaustion tokens. They're not tired anymore. They We're got... refreshed. We <laughs> took a little power nap. Both good and bad. All right. <laughs> we all have to nap. We are first up and I think we need to knock these people down. Yeah. Maybe you go first, Bellatrix, because you could grab an attack. Mm -hmm. I think that's what we're going to do. I think uh, Bellatrix is going to capture that point. Bing. And then with One point. a Aha. range of four, she's going to do Confundo. Range of four, challenge two, give the target a Confundo status card. <gasps> so that goes oh, to Hermione. Hermione. Oh, Hermione. Do you want to read it? Yeah. Yeah, what does that do? Sure. So I have two of these. This is Confundo. The next time this character does the ability action, increase the cost of the ability by one. And that's a one-time use. Yes. Then you'll remove the card and give it back to me. And when you do it again, though, it goes up to two, right? No, I just have two of them. I see. Okay. So I can do it multiple times to make your stuff cost That's more. That's difficult. Yes. A hindrance uh, in our plan. And that is a challenge of two, so I roll two die. Let's see if I can. And you also challenge two. Yes. Oh. Oh, so we need to defend. Would this you like is to roll for Range of four, challenge two. So and Hermione actually has one one die. Yeah, because oh, Hermione one. has a defense of one. So. Great. That's one hit. We need one our defense. Hit. Come on, buddy. No. Ha! Ah, we did not get that. We have knocked down a young girl. <laughs> <laughs> I've always said the best defense is a good offense, but in this case, it's yeah. not true. Honestly, I think that we're in a good position, though. So mm -hmm. now that, that they've, but... they've gone, it's our turn. We're going to have Harry turn around. And he's like, ah, my head. What is it? What's, what is that? Whoa! <laughs> he's going to run away. Uh, what? Smith. Why is Grandpa he so sultry? Voldemort. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think we're gonna have Harry use the his ability of Expelliarmus. Oh no! Oh, oh no! Yeah. We so have an item. Pay two, and we're gonna tr attempt to Expelliarmus. It's a it's a range three. Uh, it's a challenge two, so we get to roll two dice, mm. uh, and we could if we succeed, take an item uh, item card from the target and place it in the two of their cooldown tracks. No. So we can disarm because okay, okay. you have the which what item is that? The dagger. Dagger. Yeah. Don't take my dagger, dude. So we need to roll to see if we can expel the this guy right here. So we need a Don't challenge. Do it. So here we go. Here we go. Challenge two. Come on. Oh. Uh. So I got one. Oh. I protected my no. dagger. No. All right. So you didn't have to win the challenge in order to Expelliarmus us, and the dagger mm. is now on two. Oh my gosh, so we were successful because we rolled a success. No. No, it just happens. You're not going to give that much. Oh, effect. I see. Uh, you would have also knocked us down if your challenge worked. Gotcha, gotcha. That's a cool, that's stronger than I thought it was too. That's yeah. great. Cool. It's a real strong ability. Yeah, it's yeah. great, it's great. <laughs> it's great for you. Well, we got to finish yeah. uh, our move. Now remember, you can always do an attack twice. I hate to tell you, but I also want you to use up all your blue tokens. Minsley, should we move forward or fall back a little bit? I think forward. Forward? Yeah. Just let's do it. All right. Yeah. One, two. Oh! There's there a face off oh. right kiss. now. Kiss! 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 Oh, sorry, boy. Ooh. Now I'm exhausted from kissing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I feel like. We're uh, kidding. They don't have mouths. They can't kiss. Should we get Draco in there and take out our good girl, Hermione? Well, Draco's serpent mm -hmm. can do the work for us because if we knock her out, we get a point. Okay, so let's see. Ooh, Draco and the serpent minion roll, minion token roll one extra die when challenging rivals that are knocked down. <gasps> Wait, what? Bonus. Uh, okay, mm. well. Uh, oh. 
Oh. The serpent uh -oh. minion gets an That's extra not die against Tremoyne. So we're definitely doing that because the serpent token's already adjacent. Yes. So first things first, maybe Voldemort should grab that point and attack Harry. Yes. Okay. So otherwise Harry's going to take that point from under us, and that would be very embarrassing. Maybe so embarrassed. I don't know so if y'all know, know this, but uh, Lord Voldemort has something called fiend fire. <laughs> Maybe fiend we don't fire. want to because it's expensive for us because it'll take a long time to get this token back. But fiend fire mm -hmm. is a range of two mm -hmm. and a challenge six, so we get six dice against Harry. That's but honestly, all, the most we could do is knock him yeah. down. Yeah. So that's not worth Save the it. card. Save okay. It. I like it. Save it for later. Let's use a basic attack. Yes. A Pungo, an ally Voldemort can see that is within four squares may do a basic action, but no, nobody's in line of sight. Yeah. But that's a fun one to keep in mind. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and first yes. interact with D and get a point. CD. CD? Yeah. Well, 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 a young hairy boy. <laughs> Both of their noses are this right now. They're that's just... true. Okay, so <laughs> let's just uh, try and just just real simply, just hit hit Harry in the face. Do you want to run one each? <gasps> yeah. Okay. okay. Harry has Three, a defense of two. 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 One. Oh! oh! Don't even worry about it. It's fine. Well, we had four oh! successes that round, anyways. Didn't even. Well, I'm glad we didn't waste a good roll, uh, of yeah. which we only have a limited amount on uh, such a good defense. <laughs> All right, was, so that's that cool. Was, that was, that was excellent. Now Voldemort is exhausted. I think we should use this to get Her Hermione to stand up. Shit. We should yeah. use the exhaust the round to yeah, close the turn. So yeah. Hermione's going to use both actions to stand up. Yep. I didn't think about Rise, that. Rise, Hermione! Rise! I should have uh, known when we talked this out out loud that that was the wrong order of operation. It's okay. Uh -huh. no, I like but you know, failure. it was either Hermione standing back up or Harry stealing that point. No, Harry's already gone. Yeah, he's exhausted. He's exhausted. No! no. We, no. Actually, we actually could have not attacked before and just taken the point. Oh, that's oh, that's a good yeah, we point. That. No! <laughs> We've all failed a little you bit so far. At least it's balanced yeah, out. Yeah, because he could have just moved over to it. And it was uh, movement before. two, and he could have stolen it right under your feet. Oh, we yeah. didn't think we were we both in. were silly. We, we both, both, both were silly. And we have learned. I propose we... Snip. <sighs> Let's run up to Ron and attack him with our ranged attack of three. So we Do can it. go one, two, that's a move, and now he has Everte Statum. Ooh. Uh, it's a challenge two, and if I win, I can move the target two squares. Okay, we get a defensive two. Uh-huh. Yeah. Wanna do one and one? Yep. All right, let's roll. And I don't know what that was. Go. That was a okay. Hit one. We got oh. four, four, yes, four successes. Interesting, <laughs> yeah. interesting. Well, I guess we only Draco's exhausted. <laughs> Ron is an incredible wizard. Everyone, yeah. you know, like he's he's not just a Ron jokester. Ron is severely not... underrated. Yeah, yeah, yeah they should change the name of this game. I would. <laughs> <laughs> all right, what are you gonna do with Ron, Ron? and his annoying friend Harry? He gets into trouble all the time. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you know, I think Ron needs to just try and stupefy this, you know, Draco. Yeah. Oh, did your mother knit that sweater? I don't know what you're talking about. What is <laughs> don't talk about my mom. Oh, that's right. Like the, He's very posh. Yeah, his mom's great. Ron Weasley, you live in a tall, sloppy tower. Mm, I'll make you eat those words. <laughs> well, oh wait, one more die. Excuse me. Um, you had a challenge three. Uh, stupefy. Stupefy. Well, Draco only has gone. a defense of one. Would you like to roll? What? Come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. I got one success. Shield, shield, shield. Or, yes! Yeah, yeah. That's, no. Yes. Good Woo. night. Woo. Draco just went, you, what? I understand that you're. Weasley. He's just saying that on the floor. <laughs> Weasley. Oh, serpent's coming for you. Okay. So he's on the floor right here, and then um, we should just move forward, man. Yeah. Yeah, let's rock. Uh, Did you pay your can... token to do the stupid um, guys? Yeah, so that was a two. two. There we go. Mm -hmm. Cool. All right, we're gonna go one, and he's like, oh, uh, oi. Oh, he fell well, off. Mop this up, he fell and off I go this way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and that's no. going to exhaust him. What yep. a ban. All right, end of round. So let's oh. check. Nobody is at the opponent's flag. Move everything down one on Whoop. the track. All right. And you are now first player. This is so fun. I'm mm -hmm. having a blast right now. This is awesome. I like the name <laughs> cooldown track a lot. Me too. <laughs> it's a very fun name. Can and we play the cooldown track right now? Yeah. Just... Cooldown track? Yeah. <laughs> oh, if we could. Ooh, don't you want to 
Oh, that was nice. Yeah. yeah it was, felt summery. That song that we all were we all in like yeah. summer outfits there? Yeah. I imagine like we were just partying. You know? Yeah. All right. Who are you going to move? Um, I think we should have Ron try and take out Draco to get him into the exhaust oh, round. Don't do that. Sure. And we have two actions, so we get attacked twice. Yeah. If we fail the first time. Yeah. So he has. We uh, can't. So we're gonna just use our That's bad. no. Oh, just, it's, it's just a regular. Just a regular, he's just a regular challenge. So we're gonna do two two dice mm -hmm. um, against Draco's defense, which is one. Me one of them. Here we go. Come on. Okay. This is our first action for Ron. Ron Weasley. Weasley! Okay. Oh, that's three successes. <laughs> that's three successes. I didn't help. Don't worry, I got it. Three successes. Oh, oh God! I, I it was right there. I was looking at it. Well, that's how the dice work. It works, the, it works on the side that you see. Statistically, that you want to it's have. whatever is supposed to happen. <laughs> Let's not get into universal. <laughs> All right. So he is exhausted. Yeah, he goes there. He and was knocked out. Do we get a point for And you get a yeah. point. Yeah, you get a point for that. down. Because nice. that's shame. And then let's have him advance, man. Here we go. One, One two. two. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's not going well. It's like going this. very I'm well for Ron. I'm tired. Ron. All right. Here's the thing. We got Bellatrix, who's looking right at Ron and probably needs to do something about his impertinence. She has a range of four for Confundo, challenge two. Oh, she's, she's in range. I didn't realize we put her, we put yeah. her right in the open. Because I was watching this wall. Yeah, I was watching that yeah. wall too. Then again, I think that's Ron's good. already moved this turn and Malfoy is about mm. to spawn back in the starting area for next right. round. So Ooh. maybe knock out Hermione. Hermione. Yeah. Ron's going to stab him again. And then we Ron stabbed him last forward. time, by the way. With the wand. Yeah, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Ron, uh, wand, wands, wands, wands are not for stabbing. Are you okay? Yeah, no wands. <laughs> <laughs> I was so absolutely, dis look at how closed my eyes are, dis disgusted that you would say a wand is for stabbing. Yeah, that's wrong. So, uh -huh. uh, confundo, huh? Yeah. Range of four, challenge two, and you will get the confundo. Double confundoed. Mm -hmm. Did we get so double I'm... confundoed? So roll your defense. They're gonna, yeah, we got to roll a defense. How many? Oh. Well, just one for Hermione. Hermione. Okay. One. All right. Come on, buddy. One. It's one. It's one. Defense. Okay, let's do Sweet. it again. Two confundos. Oh yeah. On one little girl. They're gonna try she again. She has both of them. That's rough. That's Wait, rough. is that not? Oh no, it, just... it, the ability lands, but if they won that, then they she would have been knocked over. We actually oh, spent okay. our last okay. token like doing the, okay. confundo. Yeah. Thank you. So. We can't do anything else with her. We, we can move her towards move the flag. They should yeah, have called this Confunko, but. Boop, boop. Confunko. Right. Mm. Yeah. So Bellatrix is now exhausted. Yes. She failed her at her Confundo, but now Hermione's spells are so expensive. So, do we want to get Hermione, Hermione first? Attack? Yeah. Yeah. We can attack twice if we can. You're only allowed to do an action if you both come up with the idea at the exact same time and say it at the same time. Yeah, we know we that you told us before that. Yeah, you said it before, yeah. Minzeka? <laughs> Is she back? <laughs> She's back. I think we attack with, let's do it. Yeah. Attack twice with Hermione. Yeah, which one? On uh, on Bellatrix, because Bellatrix can score potentially to right. prevent that, so. And snakes can't score. Okay. So two, two die, here we go. One. Defending, what's your defense? The snake would like to score. Bella. Two. Bella's two. Okay, so two against two. Okay. One, two, three. Statistics. <laughs> A one success. Mm -hmm. In your face. Yeah. We're going to try again. Yeah. We're going to uh, try Ooh. again. Um, here Hang we go. on, are you User. doing this with Hermione? Yes. Yeah. And it's just a basic attack. It's just a yeah, basic attack. Anything. Exactly. Stop avoiding my confundo. We're going to attack again with Hermione. Let's one, go. Two, I feel like we've three. done this before. Statistics. Oh! You got it, you got it. My, uh, yeah. Exclamation points. No, 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 you oh, got it. Oh, gosh. <sighs> yes! yes! <laughs> ooh, See, ooh, Bellatrix ooh. laugh. It was good. Read her, <laughs> read her secret ability. Notorious Witch. Notorious Witch. When Bellatrix shifts off the cooldown track, you may place her adjacent to an alley. So when she's knocked out. To a what? When she comes to a, yeah, here, to a what? <laughs> It's because I'm used to saying alliance. Ally, ally, doesn't matter. Oh, it's from cute. another country. It's cute, I what? like it. Which one? Iceland. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so when she gets knocked out, once she comes off the cooldown track, we get to place her next to her friend. She is That's oh, great. That's a great ability. ability. Okay, well, it doesn't help us here, though. It doesn't, but it's creepy later. All right, back to our turn. Uh, only Voldemort can move, and... Something in your way. Just right here. <laughs> he says it. He says it right this yeah. close. Yeah. Like I can taste your breath. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think we run. 
do it. Okay. We're not running away. We're running towards our goal. It's a one and a two and a three and a four. Nice. Ooh, they're they're gonna score that next turn. Nope. Next round. Nope. Okay, Harry can move now. Nope. If we move Harry back here, we can get him. Well, I mean, either way, they get the first action. So, right. They're no, so we should just keep progressing forward. Um, well, come for us, young boy, young Harry boy. You can count on it. Are you sure I you mean, don't want to chase him can, with Harry? Because then Ron, when he's done being exhausted, can be the one who keeps running towards the flag. And then he's if they get to the flag too, they'll come back here. Let's, let's get him into position then. So let's run Harry after him. Yeah, Harry, Harry go on defense. Harry two, go on defense. One, yeah. two, three, four next to him here. Yeah? <laughs> it's like, you're not winning this race. Here we go. One, two, three. Double move. There we go. Hey, this is all I've ever wished for, is for you to be close to me, young Harry. We're a little you're farther just... apart than we were. Harry, hold my hand, Harry. I am so lonely, Harry. Okay, we'll hold hands. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, have fun, go heads are too but big. They're too big, they can't. <laughs> and that's, uh, we are exhausted. I'm right. exhausted. Uh, but wait, we have one more activation. He's just exhausted. <laughs> but wait. <laughs> the serpent. <laughs> You it's to activate when Draco becomes exhausted. The serpent may do a challenge too. So mm. let's hit Hermione. Let's do it. Let's hit Hermione. Okay. Leave Hermione alone. No. Okay. Gonna hit her for two. Coming at you, Hermione. Ooh. One hit. One. One right. defense. Here we go. She has one. We have to defend. Okay. We can do this. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. Let me hold your shoulder. Here we go. Nope. No, that's a fail. Ah, good oh, night, down. sweet lady. <laughs> All right. Wait, no, yeah, never mind. The, <laughs> I, thought, the, I keep thinking this is the thing. The round is now over. Please move everybody down one space on the cooldown track. We get All two tokens, tokens back. We get tokens back. Awesome. We remove everyone's exhaustion tokens. Yes. We're fine again. We will take first player token. And now we'll check to see if anybody is at a flag, which no one is. And then we get to place Draco back in the ally. starting area. I thought it was next to an ally. Everyone's different. Yeah, no, that's oh, a special yeah. ability. Otherwise, you start oh. back in your starting area. I that's think that. facing off with Ron, right there. Or even is. just stand right in front of the flag so he has to walk around you. I mean, he has to pass you at that point, but then you just shove him into the, just shove him into the wall. Or on the flag. <laughs> yes. Can you do that? Oh, I didn't know. Sounds great. Well, all he has to do is start adjacent to it. So, uh, maybe one out? That's fine. Okay. Great, 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 great. Uh, so, we're first player. We get our dagger back hey. for Lord Voldy. Voldy boy, got your stabby stab. Uh, maybe he stabby stabs with the dagger for a challenge two, and then may do an extra non-challenge action, yep. which would be to move. Yep. We could pick up Bellatrix. Correct me if I'm wrong, and then moving at the flag. Because then Bella would be available. Bella can't do anything except stand up this turn. That's if she stands herself up though, right? Oh. But if Goldy Boy stands her up. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's the assist action. Oh. Okay, love it, great idea. Let's have Draco activate first, and okay. then uh, at the end when he becomes exhausted, then the serpent can attack Hermione. Unless Hermione gets stood up before we get back to her. She can't because this is part of our activation. Can we do this all the same turn? Mm -hmm. Great. First, we're gonna do with Draco, Everte Statum for one token on the two. And uh, that is a range of three challenge two to Ron. Awesome. Uh, so, mm, Weasley, I'll challenge <laughs> oh, you. Oh, oh. Um, I'm not scared of you. <laughs> That's great. Hello? One on one? Yeah. Here we go. Yep. Oh, that's four. Okay. Even, we, can't, we can't even. I mean, okay. you can't. Nope. There's no way. Hey, I took Yeah! Wow. All right. So Ron is prostrate. Right? Wow. Solid move. Mm -hmm. Prostrate. Good play. It's, a, okay. it's a word, right? Yes, that's true. Thank yeah. you. And it, it means used, what I think it means? It was used it, the right way. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Good, good, good. My brain didn't like it. At least so. everyone in this room <laughs> agrees. <laughs> Nicely done. All right, so now Draco has become exhausted, which means the serpent may either challenge two or move three, and he will challenge Hermione. How about 
Uh, ooh, ooh, here's a fun thing. Draco and the Serpent Minion token roll one extra die when challenging rivals that are knocked down. So, three ooh. dice against Moini. No. I think it's your turn to roll, my lady. I just rolled. You did? Yeah, but here, I'll blow. And we have one? Yeah. Very cool. Oh, that's gonna be rough. Oh, oh they can't, there's no way. Yeah. There's a way. We go oh, no, have one defense. No, no, <laughs> that's four successes. Yeah, no. You got a defense though. <gasps> oh, sweet Hermione, no. baby. You are knocked out and we will take a token. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Right. yeah. I don't think oh, they're gonna attack do. Ron. We should have Harry attack Voldemort and then try to take out one of them if they're successful. <laughs> so we're gonna flipendo. Mm -hmm. It's gonna exhaust. Uh, or it's four. Four. It's four. It's f oh, it's four. That's fine. That's fine. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna get three attacks against Voldemort. And then you can push us back one square. Yeah. yeah. If you are successful. Oh no. Nope, just you just get to do it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Here we go. Come on. Magic. That's what we success is. Okay, well, uh, Voldemort gets one die, but we can still all get it. Yeah, if you roll if you roll uh, the it's exclamation cool. marks. Oh my gosh. Come on. That would be extraordinary. It'd be one in six. Wait, how many are it? <laughs> That's one success. That means we win that, and Voldemort is flipendo! Flip! <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna put him, which which square? Right here, right? Yeah. Yeah, right there. Wait, no, wait, oh yeah. We, gotta move we, can't, we can't move him here. Okay. And that's one action. Let's try to take him out. Okay. Who who do you think we should take out? Bellatrix or, or Voldemort? You're not adjacent not to Bellatrix. Bellatrix. Oh, so then, do you wanna expend this again? Let's do it. Yeah. Let's use Let's it. Let's do it. We're gonna do that again. We're gonna flipendo again on Voldemort. Because this was so fun. Wee! Wee! I love how they said they were gonna get rid of Voldemort. That was fun, right? That was funny. <laughs> Please. All right. Good pun. You ready? Oh, it's yeah. you now. It's three, you know? I know. I'll take the third dice. I, b I believe in you. Why? Oh, I well, now I don't know if I believe in you. <laughs> Again, this is not skill. This is Please. statistics. <gasps> yeah! Statistics. <laughs> statistics. <laughs> and Voldemort is Rid out of there. Of. then what? <laughs> when Voldemort is knocked out, place him in your starting area and then you may immediately move him to squares. Place him in your starting area and then move him to squares. Looks good to me. Now, it doesn't say he's still knocked out. I, I believe if he can move, then he is still standing up and he wasn't exhausted yet this turn. So I think he still gets to go because he is because he didn't the walk enough. Lord. Okay. All right. So we gotta defend. Yeah. If you're gonna attack. Now you well, attacked just... us twice with Flubindo? Yeah. Yes. Okay, so it comes back to us. It is our turn. Mm -hmm. If we hit Ron, mm -hmm. then we don't get to move over to Bellatrix and stand her up, so that means she wouldn't get to do anything this turn. I think that we should move away from the side of the board, start going for the flag, so we should go in and pick up Bellatrix and just go get the flag. Or we just try and kill Ron twice, and then... Uh... Mm. But then my concern, he's gonna come back at the starting area, which is where we're trying to get to. Let's <laughs> wake up Bellatrix and have her go for Harry. Okay. Make your move. Okay, so Voldemort's gonna move one, two, and he will assist. Yes. Yep, yes, yes. And that's his whole turn. That exhausted him. Whew. Okay, good. Ron gets to stand up though. So we're gonna exhaust Ron, use two turns to stand him up. Yep. Awesome. Yeah. Two actions to stand him up. Okay, should we move in just straight up melee attack? Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Excuse me, <gasps> Who's right behind oh! <laughs> <laughs> So, roll two dice at him. Come on. I'm not afraid of you. You should be. One. Okay, come on. No! Ah. No, Harry! Harry Potter, oh, the babe. famous Harry Potter. Oh, that's uh, not good. No. Yeah. I was oh, gonna I say, you can Harry one of them. That is the end of a round! Mm -hmm. All right, first let's assess if anyone is in the opponent's starting area. No one is. Now, let's move everything down on the cooldown track. Cool down track. Yep. Awesome, so now, these points are going to go back. Points? Yes. Where were they? A is where Hermione came and got it over here in Gringotts. B is up towards your flag on the opposite side. Mm -hmm. 
And, oh my. And then uh, Hermione gets to go anywhere in the starting area. Well, at the beginning of our turn, um, because of Ron's ability team player, um, if he's standing, we can bring in an ally uh, who comes off a of cooldown and is placed next adjacent to him. So we're going to put Hermione right here. And then we're going to have her move forward two, one, two, to get her into scoring position. And we're going to. Granger, is that you? It's me. It's me, Hermione, Hermione Granger. Solid. So then we're going to have Hermione do Impedimenta mm -hmm. on on uh, Draco, which, because of your Confundo, will pay uh, have an additional cost. So we'll put it, put it yep. up to a three cooldown. You're welcome. And that just lets us move <laughs> one of your tokens up on the cooldown track. <laughs> And we also have, she's been holding this thing the whole time, uh, Felix Felicis, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. that lets us uh, set one of our die to mm -hmm. um, uh, three. That's yeah, to three successes. Yeah. So we get, it's two attacks, or two um, challenges, excuse me. One of them's on, automatically three successes, and we will roll the other one. And, and that's four, four successes. successes. Wow, that's gross. So you're saying you've been holding this potion the whole time, Granger? Never doubt a mudblood. All right, what? well, well she would say that. She we're would. rolling I one die, know. so right. we yeah. cannot win. So Draco goes Pop. to sleep. Also, one of your, uh, because of the impedimenta it was successful, one of your, yeah, goes up the, mm. goes up in the cooldown track. Mm -hmm. It cool. heats up. And she was, that was a big <laughs> turn for her. She came back strong, and she is now exhausted. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, Draco's not feeling great. Oh, we're gonna take her really regretting Voldemort being so far away. Mm -hmm. Now, Voldemort can do a very expensive maneuver called Fire Fiend, which means he gets to roll six dice. So he could really give it to Harry. Ooh. And then that would take one, two to move, and then another to attack Harry. But then nobody can go back for That's Malfoy. Fine. Let's take out Harry. Let's get that flag. Get out of here. Yeah, and then uh, Bellatrix could just be standing there and if, if we get rid of Harry. Let's get rid of Harry. Okay, so Harry could stand up if we go, don't go right away. So we got to move, and we'll keep him out of line of sight of Ron. Nice. Mm. And then say, oh, it's the boy who lived. And then let's use our fiend fighter. And it's a range of two. So maybe instead of landing there, we land within a range of two, so that we're closer to the A for next turn. Mm. Uh, and then we'll roll six. Like How about you roll three, I roll three? Let's do it. Come on, Harry. Now we can pummel him into the dust, right? Absolutely. Okay. Oh, no. <gasps> oh, that oh, got That was off. a success. Whoa. That was. Oh, ah! wow. <laughs> Wait, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight attacks. What's your boy I who mean, lived power? He exploded. We can change one of our things to a defense. <laughs> well, let's give it a shot. <laughs> All right, ready? Oh, that's oh, not bad. That, that wasn't bad. bad. You got bad. four. Not enough, though. This boy didn't live. <laughs> wow. Uh, we will take one point for knocking him okay. into wow. oblivion. Yeah, it's a close game. And then. I just want to point out, Correct. Boy Who Lived is a pretty low bar for a title, but. Pass. <laughs> 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 We've been dealing with it for a, over a decade. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, so Lord Voldemort is now exhausted and the turn passes to y'all. Okay, great. Great. Um, let's get let's... rid of Malfoy to get the point. What do you think? Or should we rush for B? You can move through allies. We should move Ron here so we get four points. Can we get four points like that? Yeah. yeah. Wait, you can double up on the flag? Yeah. Yeah. Why didn't know what to tell me? We're going to definitely that. do We're that. We're going to just do that. Yeah, one, one two, two, three. three. Flip! Oh, yes! Four. Ron is exhausted. Well. Draco is exhausted, so all he can do is move his little snake. Good on him. Uh, so I think it's time to make Bellatrix run for the exit, yeah? Yes. Okay, let's just have a run. Yep. One, two, three, Great. four, and oh. your turn. Harry Potter is exhausted. Harry Potter is down. So. Uh, but place the exhaustion token as your turn. Okay. Because uh, the reason for doing that is because you could have, if you had any reason to, delay Ron moving so that we wouldn't have seen it coming, maybe, by placing your exhaustion token at Alan Harry Potter for that whole activation that turn. Oh. See what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what you're saying. You stall a little bit with that. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, so we will exhaust Draco, and when that happens, we get to move his serpent token. One, two, three is the Serpent's activation, and then that's the end of a round, friends. And so, mm. 
It says, when a round ends, check to see if any of your standing characters are on or adjacent to your opponent's flag marker. If so, you may choose to return one or more of those characters to your starting area. So let's do, I'm gonna do that for Bellatrix. Are you yes. doing that for both of yours? Let's take, let's take the, the let's four. Take them. Yeah, we'll take We're them. gonna take the four. We're gonna take the four. We'll take the four. Okay, okay move good. your characters back to your starting area. Woo! And you get. Oh, they're so far. <laughs> Help. One, two, three, four points. We'll take two points for Bellatrix and. We're at Let's eight. Let's see, uh, do you have any preference where she starts? That is great for okay. me. Cool, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six points. Yeah. You've got eight points. And now move everything down on the cooldown tracks. Harry's gonna respawn. And he gets to respond next to Ron. I think we put him in the hallway. In the hallway? Yeah. Well, we'll respond him right here. Uh, that's not uh, your starting area. It's only the no. six well, spots because of, adjacent to your flag. Well, because of Ron's ability team player, if Ron is standing, an ally that shifts off the cooldown track maybe plays adjacent to him. So we could put so him, we, put we don't need gotcha. to put him, yeah. Oh wait, can we, we, can we just switch them? Oh, that's because we could have put them anywhere. Well, technically. Are they in the same That's places? your one mulligan. <laughs> <laughs> and then here. Yeah. Great. Great. All right. Ooh, uh, remove all exhaustion tokens from your characters and we will take the first player token. Boop. Thank you. Let's lower our cooldowns. Did we? We did. There we yeah. go. Okay, sweet. And. Malfoy gets to stand up when he uh, spent his entire turn to stand last round. Forgot to do that. That was my bad. I am sorry, so I took my one mulligan. <laughs> uh, all right, so maybe we move Bellatrix towards these points over here and chill. Mm -hmm. That sounds good to me. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Just run real fast towards him. She won't be able to pick anything up. I have a plan. Okay. Okay. It's come down to this. One, this is pretty close. Two, three, four. Mm -hmm. All right. Feeling good. Okay, that's their move. Let's use Ron's this thing and move Hermione. Okay. Okay. Right. So uh, we're using Ron's renovate to renovate to um, <laughs> to move Hermione here. I'm gonna put in a new kitchen marble in my renovation. That's what they love, kitchen marble. <laughs> <laughs> As opposed but to then, bathroom marble. This is this is Ron's action, but this yeah. is Ron's action. We can also move Harry. So you've activated Ron? Yeah, Ron is activated right now. Um, we can also move Harry though, because he can move up to two allies. Yeah, let's so, do that. So we're gonna move Harry uh, one, two, so he's closer here. Okay. And that's, um, that, was, that was Ron's renovate ability, so he has one more action. Yeah. Is that snake a token? Yeah. Oh, then we're, then we're gonna use Reducto. Reducto. Choose a token Ron can see within three squares, remove it from the map. So that's one point for us. So there's only one, only one cost. So we're gonna do that to the snake. Reducto. Bye bye. Way easier. Yeah. Ron doesn't know how to do spells. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and Ron is exhausted. Cause he did a lot this turn. <laughs> Yes, he's very accomplished. Yeah, she's out of control. I think we should get this point and try and knock Hermione on her butt. So we'll move for our first action, then we're face to face and we'll play a dagger Ah, uh, I was like, what are you doing? That's a whole nother action. Yeah. Never mind, We'll dagger. play our dagger and then we can do a challenge two and then do a second action to pick up that point. And would you like to roll? I think you should do it, master. You have that great plan going. Oh, Ooh. come on, Hermione. You are the master planner. <gasps> Come on. <laughs> All right, we'll just pick up the point to be on our way. No way. Unbelievable. <laughs> oh my gosh. Against Voldy Boy? Yeah, against Voldy Boy. That's right. Against Voldy Boy. Okay, so. It's weird when they're kids. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so now we're going to move. It, somebody move wrote Harry. about it. We're going to move Harry Potter. Mm -hmm. um, Harry Potter. Here we go. So use one. Yeah, in front so that she. Right here. Yeah. yeah. And then pick And then we're going to use the second action to take. Control point B. Uh -huh. Here's a point. It's gonna go exhaust it, put it uh, in the four exhaust, and we get a point, one point away from potentially winning. Great, and now uh -huh. Harry Potter is exhausted. Exhausted. Unbelievable. Ooh. All right, well there's little that we can do, but I wanna sp spawn another serpent, cause it's, it's fun. Uh, I'm paying three for Serpent Socha. Yes, he's going to, oh, let's move one, two. Okay. One, two. <laughs> now we're gonna spawn within a range of two. One, two. Yeah. And now there's still nothing we can do. <laughs> <laughs> but the serpent will move. One, two. 
almost in our way. Almost entirely in your mm -hmm. way. Mm -hmm. Almost. Uh huh. Uh, Completely. Hermione is going to try to attack. Just regular attack. Yep. Uh, Voldemort is our last character. That's two attacks. Mm -hmm. Well, Voldemort, two successes. He loves being knocked out. Voldemort is knocked down, mm -hmm. and that will exhaust all of our characters, and that will end the round. Okay. Going into the next round. Well, guess what? Nobody captured anybody's flag then. That's okay, true. Slide everything down. Mm -hmm. Yep. And you get the first player token, <laughs> and we'll take our exhaustion tokens off the characters. And now, Harry Potter. The boy not only lived, but, but who flipped <laughs> and one space won. No! Yes! Yes! Our evil plans <laughs> are thwarted! Why do the bad guys always lose? It's not fair. We should win sometimes. Okay. Occasionally, statistically. <laughs> okay, well, it was, fair. it was fair, though, so let's just clarify. It was fair. <laughs> oh, man. That well, done, well done, well done, well done. Well done, well done, well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Yeah. Wait, well, yeah. That was okay. such a yeah. fun game. I loved it so much. Aww. Me too. Yeah. I like the tactile on this of all the pieces. I like yeah. that you can physically flip stuff. Again, mm, yes, I've said yes, that before. But. Absolutely. I, I love how big the heads of Funkos uh, are. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. So, yeah, big heads. I love how beady their eyes are. Now, can yeah. they break dumps is the real question. Oh! oh yes. Go, Voldy. <laughs> <laughs> what? Don't do that holding a dagger. Oh, not safe. <laughs> well, friends, thank you for playing Harry Potter Funko first with me. Yeah. I love you very much, and it's great to have you here. So oh, fun. we love you. Yeah. Well, yeah. I guess I want to be friends. Bye, friends. <laughs> Thanks for joining us on Game the Game. See you next time.